Hello everyone, this is Funtos playing Hero of Dreams. Centuries ago, the land of Hyrule was in ruins. Hope faded as darkness covered the land. No one could defeat the evil king. Blood spilled, and there was no hope in sight. Until, a young boy who held the Master Sword came to save Hyrule, and he sent the evil king to the Dark World to never return. And yet, the hero of time aged, and in the long course of years, eventually perished. So when the evil king found a way to return, the world again was in doubt. However, the hero wins saved the world. So did the hero of light. Then, with the final blow, the hero of courage killed the evil king forever. All of the heroes had one thing in common. The bloodline. And Golden Sun music, because why not? Link, get your sorry butt home! And no excuses this time. <laughs> I have a, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna narrate unless you guys want me to. Your name is on the house. Uh, I better get go home before I get introduced to the paddle again. So here's our protagonist man, Lunk. He uh, he moves around and stuff. And I spent some time making sure the controls worked for this game before, you know, going forth with the thing. So, you know, I got a pause button. It's great. And I got a, I got a map button, but I don't have a map yet. So, ah, uh, here's my house. Let's go to my house. That sounds like a lovely idea. Here's my grandpa. Shouldn't you be going to sleep? It's past your bedtime. I want a bedtime story! I remember the first flower I ever grew! A magnificent sprout it was! I called it Quest Sprout, Mr. grow a -Lot. I loved it more than my worthless children. I'm gonna go take off. Uh, let's take off to sleep? Nope. Take off to somewhere. Where am I going? That's a good question. Or er, there's not really much in terms of direction for me here, so I guess I'll just wander about until I see something nifty. Hello, house. How are you? You are a house, but you are currently closed. Hmm. And there's some shells, and there's a shop, but it's also closed. What does this mean? That's a good question. Well, I go over here, and there are evil bushes in the way. Well, I can't do anything about that. It looks like these um these rocks have a smiley face on them, but I think it's just the way that the thing looks. And I'm going to want to figure out how to get rid of that FPS thing in the bottom left corner, because that's going to get annoying. But, uh, uh, oh, I think I figured out my house. It says Lunk. Lunk, 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 there's a door back here. Lunk, 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 old man, hecky there. Lunk, it's past your bedtime. Now go to bed, before I ground you or something. Okay, grandpa and grandpa, because apparently there are multiple grandpas. Sleep time. This is a weird dream, at least I'm not pregnant. Okay. You know what, yeah. You can be what sleepy. You can be whatever you want in the dreamland, because the dreamland is the dreamland. Ah, this is the uh, Column of Forest music. How nice. And so we travel around. Guess I'll go this way. Oh. Tonight is the battle that will determine the fate of our world. Overtake Fulton and reopen the Temple of Light. As your commander, I promise victory! And in this victory, we will... Is this... Mega Man X music? Okay. We will become closer to the capture of Hyrule. They call themselves people and enlightened. And yet, they banished us. And why? left us to die, and when we reached out for help, they killed my brother. Not their brother. 
Let us live up to the name Dark Army. And so... Hold on, sir, I need to tie my shoe. Hmm. Oh, he better tie his shoe. Oh. Okay, well, you tie your shoe, buddy. Now I can go the- Oh, hi, how you doing? Ah, enemy dudes! Well, I don't have a sword or anything, so I'm just gonna- just gonna dodge stuff. Excuse me, sirs. Who are you? Do you think you could stop us from taking Fulton? Well, Mr. Skirt? Where did he go? Oh, well. What? Why is the Friends theme playing? <laughs> okay. It's, it's a lovely, lovely rendition. Here's our protagonist! Brad Pitt! Cause, you know, that's, that's how it be. And here's our protagonist. That guy from Karate Kid movies. Okay, cool. And many more people. But let's get to the game. Okay, that works for me. Chapter one, the hero awakens. Cause you know, he does that sort of thing. You know, he's asleep. He awakens. Heck yeah. He awoke real good. Look at that. And Grandpa's not here anymore, but there is a stump. I guess I'll have to come back here when I get the hammer of glory. If I even remember. And now there are enemies all over the place. Cool! Well, I still don't have a weapon, so I guess I'll just wander by- Hey, look! It's a- it's a hat! No, not a hat, it's a statue. It's the same thing. You know, statue, hat, no difference. You wear them both in your head. Okay, so I guess, um, I could go back to where I remember there being a sword picture, but I don't know if that's going to be what I need to do. But I'll just wander about until something happens here. Oh. This is the clock house. It's where there's a clock. And there's some dudes here. Link, think the gods are here. My house has been stolen. Wait, what? Uh. Okay. My spare key is at the Robin's house. Okay, so training sword for going to the Robin's house and uh, saving a place. Okay, sounds good. I just have to, you know, get there. Uh, let's see. Where is the Robin's house? That is a good question. Hmm. Do you guys know where the Robin's house is? Oh. I at least have a- oh, no, actually I'm taking damage. Are you the Robin's house? You are the Robin's house. I can tell because it says it. Hello. What's with the creatures crawling over the island? You just got these same creatures from the dream the other day. It's your time to be the hero. Hmm, what kind of tagline of a hero could this guy be? I'm not sure yet. Mr. Frost sounds really cold. Okay, well, that's that's nice and all. I'm gonna push you this. Hello. Link, you game! The island is attacked! It's time. Uh, like a son to me, Link. <laughs> what? Oh, uh, like a son to me, Link. There was no par comma. I gotta get the sword. I have a spare! Oh, I did have the key. Curse you, Red! Hmm. I wonder what the solution to this puzzle is. Oops. <laughs> the controls are a little slippery, as you can tell. I, I like, inched around it, and then that bugged me out a little bit. Hey, Red, you're blue. Here's the key to the place. I got the key, and I guess I'll come back here when I can pick up pots. Or destroy pots. I'll just have to, you know, wander about at some point. Oh, oh, thanks. 
I, I, I know. I, I know. Oh, that didn't help. Wait, did that say mood? Uh, yes, I, I know. I, I know there's the, 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 okay, thank you. Does that say mood? My, my mood is winky face. Okay, cool. I have the winkiest face you'll ever see. Wink, wink. So I got the key. Now I need to find the house. Where's the house? The house that got stolen for some reason. <laughs> Um, well, it's not that way. It's probably this way. Ow. Goodness. I'm gonna die at this rate. Hmm, but we'll, we'll see if I can, uh, sneak my way to the house that is locked. Is it this house? It is this house. Ooh, spoopy music. What have we here, some teenage punk? Ha 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 ha! I stole this house! <laughs> you're lucky you're behind the counter? I will... So there. Yeah. All you guys behind the counter. There's some little guys, they're like, Hello, we're gonna walk around. And this is the part where you pushy some blocks like this and this. Man, this is complicated shenanigans land. Look at that. And you push that one and it opens the door. There's a key there. Ooh, but it's like just sitting where a box is. I did it. I got the box key. Yeah, okay, this guy is, is being walkie man. And I need to avoid Walkie Man because I have no way to defend myself still. But that's okay. I'm on floor one, as you can see in the bottom right corner of the map up top. But it looks like there's only one floor anyway, so... Oh, they're all gone. Okay. So here we got another puzzle. Pushy Block Puzzle Parade. Pushy all the blocks. Pushy them with your socks. Oh, jeez, I gotta be careful. I don't want to die, you know. I'm trying my best not to die, but I'm, I'm one guy. Oh, there are some green friends in that room, but I cannot do anything about that, so I'm just gonna pushy some blocks. Oh, I found it. Cool! Alright, I need that spare sword... Uh, I'm gonna guess it's in here. And there it is! I got the sword! Now I can poke things, um, and almost die. Okay, well let's try and not die. Uh, I would like health. Oh, jeez. Uh, health is good. Health is great. I'm gonna poke you in the face. Um... Yeah, health would be nice. Let's go backwards and see if I can't get some health from um, Colonel Sam and the Mustard Gang. Eh, or I could die. <laughs> let's save. That's a good idea. Okay, let's 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 play the game. Uh, I have a sword now, so I mean. At least, you know, that's that's good. Alright, let's return to the house of first and uh, finish the house of first. This time I can poke things. Oh, now you give me health. Harumph, I say. Harumph! I've been waiting all this time, but no. You have to hide your smelly hearts from me. Uh, I don't think I need to go back to the right side. Yeah, I think I just need to go to the left. Yeah, I'm gonna put the entire blame on dying there to the fact that I had to dodge a whole bunch of stuff up to that point. <laughs> it happens. But now I have a pokey thing, so I can poke things, you know, like... Like... Like this. It's, it's great fun. 
There's one for the whole family. Poke your friends. Just not with a sharp object. Poke them with your finger. Poke. Oh. Now there are two of them. I wanted to see if there was anything special in this room. Aha! 50 rupees! Maybe I should clean up every room and see if there's anything special. Why do sometimes the- oh, there's a cracked wall here. Okay, I might need to return to this place once I get bombs. I don't have bombs yet. Hey, buddy. Why is it that sometimes these guys bounce back when you poke them and- oh, hey, bombs. Yeah! <laughs> It's like fates, like, hey, look at me, I am bombs. Get some lovely prizes there. Yeah, I might as well clear out every room and see if there's anything special to doing so. I'm behind the counter now. Boop. I poke Mario in the nose. Or in the schnoz, if you prefer. Whichever way you'd prefer to describe someone's nostril. Uh, holder. Then by all means, refer to it as such. Alright, dudes here. Yeah, sometimes the the enemies, they just don't care that you hit them, and they just walk at your face. It's very confusing. Let's see. I need to move this one first, then this one, then this one, then this one, then this one, and now I move this one. Oh, I mean, it really didn't matter. Alright, let's poke some dudes. Okay, nothing for the furthest right. Okay. Well, yeah, it's nice and clean of enemies now. So we'll just... Oh, I can destroy pots now. That is very helpful. Okay, cool. Didn't realize I could do that. Because, yeah, um, this is my first time playing a Hero Classic game. So my knowledge of what you can and can't do with all the objects is... A little missing in places. We'll just have to see as we go. Oh, these guys are back. And for some reason, sometimes they still just don't care. Is it maybe because I poke them in the side? Or don't poke them with the edge of my sword? No. Well, this guy's against the wall, so he's not a good test. Scary's if all of them would uh, allow me to pushy them, but no. Just the one. Oh, now I get hearts. <laughs> Alright, I'll go ahead and make sure that I don't get anything for uh, cleaning up this room. Though I think I already did that. I don't remember. Well, you know, thoroughness is thoroughness. Yep. Alright, time to go in the last room. Man, if I had known, I would have uh, fought the broken the pot. Didn't I tell you to get out of there? I have a million of cousins, and they will seek revenge if I'm killed. -ha -ha -ha. Hey, buddy, poke. How could I lose? Oh, it's because you know you're you're one dude, and I have maximum rupees, I think, and I have a sword. Yeah. I wonder if I can use it to cut down the bushes in the northwest part of the island. I was just doing this in front of the house or something. There's a tree right here. Oh, I see. You can actually go behind the tree in this game. But yeah, I guess now... I'm gonna cut some bushes. Yeah! Oh, you can get over 99. That makes sense. You know, 99 was probably the maximum in the original, but... Or maybe it was 9.99. It was probably 9.99, and I just for some reason think it's 99 because of the way the X goes. Anyway, I wanted to go to the house that had a mouse. It wasn't that house. Uh, it was the house that had um, some, some, some stuff. Was it, was it this house? Yeah, it was this house. I'm gonna go ahead and go and see what's hiding in that thing. Don't get close to that guy or else I'll have some talking again. I wouldn't want that. Yes, 
Yes. Okay, push you that. <laughs> I reset the puzzle by talking to the kid. <laughs> I walked around him. That works for me. Hmm. Nothing in here? I guess this is a later thing. Okay. So that answers that question, and I guess that's going to do for our first session of the almighty adventures of the hero of green clothes. And next time we progress ourselves, we will progress ourselves to the northwest and stuff. Let me pull this guy. Yeah.